where are you going, honey? I, I, I'm looking for the captain of that ship. The ship? <laughs> well, he's a hard man to see, unless you're looking at him. Well, am I looking at him? Hey, you're smart. I like that. Now, state your business, legal or illegal. Legal or illegal? Illegal? Yeah, I guess. It's hard to say. Yeah, well, illegal costs more. Well, I have money. Gold. Gold? Well, oh, please. <laughs> yeah. Gold and illegal. Oh, that's a good combination. <laughs> Do we have to speak here? Well, for illegal, I like the sort of society that's represented here. Both the uh, preoccupied and the reside. <laughs> oh, All right, hold on. That's enough! Hold on there! Jeez, now. Uh, do you carry vampires as passengers? Where to? I don't know. Well, that's good. Yeah, let me see your gold. Yeah, I'll keep this. No one comes on board after midnight. But you'll do it. What do you think? Do you think I'm the sort that can be trusted? No, I was just making sure. Sonny, you can check my reputation in every harbor of the world. And uh, no one's hauled more illegal cargo. No one. No one has hauled more desperados, more criminals, more vagabonds, more illegals of every description. Would I have that kind of reputation if I couldn't be trusted? The deal's done, then. Done. If your friends meet the deadline I set, midnight. gave me a job. He asked me to book tickets for all of you on a ship that would leave first light tomorrow morning. And how do we get from the cemetery to docks? Uncle Ludwig hasn't figured that out yet. Oh, yeah. yeah, that's the tricky part. I know. Oh, and Rudiger, Uncle Ludwig called me Thor. Did he? Uh, well, I gotta be going. It's almost dinner time. I'll pick you up tonight. Will there be any trouble with you getting out? Not tonight. It's Halloween. Whatever that. You know what Halloween is? Tonight is All Souls Eve, the feast of the dead. Cubans dress up and go out, and we call it Halloween. It's the one night of the year we don't go out at all. We don't venture forth, as Uncle Ludwig would put it. It's a night of contemplation. Well, that's why you don't know about it, then. Oh, I'll think about it. Oh! Wow! So, Rudiger gave you this costume? Uh-huh. Wow. They must be rich. This is excellent material. And it fits you perfectly. Do they have it specially made for you? I think so. His aunt and uncle indulge him, you know. I don't know if I approve of that, Anton. Well, the rich are not like the rest of us. No, they're not. I remember it as if it were yesterday. Why are we doing this? We'll never get these carpets to the ship. I believe in being ready, whatever happens.
a way to spend All Souls' Eve, when we should be contemplating all the dead souls, our own included. We don't even know if Valentine or Thor has found his ship. That was a lot of gold you gave him. You know what humans are like when it comes to gold. We can trust Thor. Then why hasn't he come back? Would you if he were human? But he'll come back. You'll see. Why don't you fly around and knock on our front door and ask for me? Are you kidding? No, I'm serious. My parents would just think that you're dressed up for Halloween. I'm not in the mood for games. Hmm. Well, try it. I did you a favor this afternoon. I visited your family. Okay. What have I got to lose? Oh, very oh. good. Well, you look very convincing. But of course, you already know that. Yes, last night all my beliefs about vampires being creatures of fantasy left me just for a moment. <laughs> That'll be Rudiger. Mm. Suppose he's a vampire too. Yeah, oh, you look wonderful. Let me see the two of you side by side. You see? Huh? Robert! Yeah. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Who do you think is the more convincing as a vampire? Oh, gee, I, 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 I couldn't, I couldn't say. Mm -hmm. I think, I think your face isn't quite pale enough. Mm-hmm. Mm. I'll be back in just a minute. I just... Mom, we're in a hurry. Oh, boy, I wish I had film for my camera. Smile, smile, Julie. Here we are. Uh, okay. There. I defy anyone to say that you are not the real thing. <laughs> Good night, all. Good night. Good night. Good night. Have fun. Night. Collect lots of candy. Candy. Yeah. <laughs> I know. He's trying. Anton looks great. I know. against me does not extend to times such as these. We've lowered our standards. We even admit humans now. What is the news, though? Well, the captain has agreed, but he says your coffins have to be on board by midnight or it's no go. He took the gold, anyway. He insisted. It is quite impossible to get seven coffins to the quay by midnight since we can't use the streets. Seven? Aunt Hildegard insists that we um, take the others with us. I have an idea. Walking over here for man. You walked? How did you avoid the humans? We didn't. It's Halloween. And there's hundreds of humans in costume. They took no notice of us. Or if they did, they simply admired what we were wearing. Costumes? Yes, what I'm wearing. But you and Thor dressed identically. On him, it's a costume. On me, it's clothes. Rudiger, that is brilliant. But there's no time. Seven coffins and miles to walk. Great. I'll get my game.